When a car is losing power during acceleration, but no engine codes are coming up, it can be a bit tricky to diagnose. Here are some things you should check. Fuel system. The first thing to suspect is a fuel delivery issue. If the engine isn't getting the right amount of fuel, it won't perform well. Consider these components. 1. Fuel filter. A clogged fuel filter can restrict fuel flow, causing power loss. 2. Fuel pump. If the fuel pump is failing, it might not be sending enough fuel to the engine. 3. Fuel injectors. Dirty or clogged fuel injectors can lead to inadequate fuel delivery. Airflow. The engine also needs a precise amount of air to mix with the fuel for optimal combustion. 1. Air filter. A dirty air filter can choke off the air supply, leading to poor engine performance. 2. Mass airflow sensor, MAF. This sensor measures the amount of air entering the engine. If it's dirty or malfunctioning, it can cause incorrect air fuel mixture. Exhaust system A blocked exhaust can prevent the engine from expelling spent gases, which can reduce power. 1. Catalytic converter. If this becomes clogged, it can severely restrict exhaust flow. 2. Exhaust leaks. Leaks before or after the catalytic converter can affect the engine's performance. Ignition system. If the fuel and air mixture isn't ignited properly, it can lead to poor acceleration. 1. Spark plugs. Worn or fouled. Spark plugs can misfire and reduce power. 2. Ignition coils. If these are failing, the spark might not be strong enough to ignite the fuel. Transmission. Sometimes the issue is with the transmission rather than the engine. 1. Transmission fluid. Low or dirty transmission fluid can cause poor performance. 2. Transmission slipping. If the transmission is slipping, it won't transfer the engine power effectively. Other considerations. 1. Vacuum leaks. A leak in the vacuum system can disrupt the engine's air-fuel mixture. 2. Sensors. Even if they're not throwing codes, sensors like the oxygen sensor, O2, throttle position sensor, TPS, and others can be providing incorrect data. Consider getting a professional diagnosis if you've gone through these checks and still can't find the issue. It's frustrating, but starting with these areas can help you narrow down the problem.